New here at three, running a 5K can be challenging as it is, right? But imagine doing it while living with a motor disability. That's what one 11 year old is trying to accomplish. Here's ABC Action News reporter Robert Boyd with the story. Go, Freddy, go. Fred Jinman may not have the legs of an athlete, but he certainly has the heart. That's a message I think Fred has to everyone. Don't stop, even though we are under coronavirus times. Fred is on day three of a 10-day 5K. The goal is 10 laps a day or 500 meters around the Ronald McDonald House of Tampa Bay Courtyard. The physical therapy we do here, it's very modern, very sophisticated, and it's giving Fred um, a hope. Fred and his mom, Isabella, are from Brazil. They have spent more than 600 nights at the Ronald McDonald House of Tampa Bay since 2012, as Fred receives treatment for cerebral palsy. The goal is to one day walk on his own. That's our dream, that's our goal, that's what we envision every night. The family says Ronald McDonald House has been there for them every step of the way, and now they want to return the favor. All money raised in support of Fred's fun run will go back to helping families like their own. Since the beginning, the Ronald McDonald's House has embraced our mission to get Fred walking freely. Ronald McDonald House acknowledges it's been a tough year. Their costs have increased while their funding has decreased during the pandemic. They appreciate Fred and Isabella's desire to give back. It's just been really special and heartwarming for us. They've embraced and been uh, just a veteran of the house. The families look to them for advice and just look for them for inspiration because they've been here for so long. For the next week, people can sign up to sponsor Fred and donate money in his name and mission. Fred even encourages others to run alongside him virtually. If I am able to do it. Everyone can do it. Everyone can do it. In St. Pete, Robert Boyd, ABC Action News.